Hey y'all, it's Courtney Shanice back with another banger. So y'all today. This is just a quick little video, maybe five minutes of your time. Um, I will be discussing how to keep your nipple piercings clean properly, the right way. Cause I used to do it the wrong way. And it took me like a whole year. It's going on a year for these to heal properly. So keep watching. Keep listening in. I will be revealing the video, my live video of me getting them pierced. Your girl was a G, okay? A G. Okay, so I'm gonna show y'all what to use. And it's similar to my face, my face, uh, my face products. But yeah. Um. So let's get started. Okay. Excuse this pimple. Yeah, I don't know what is going on. Anyway, I just got out the shower. Um, and I was like, you know, the people need to know how to clean their piercings. Because when I went to get mine pierced, I was in Port Arthur, Texas. Um, and y'all, it's crazy. So I got a tattoo, and I can't show y'all, but it's on my back. Um, maybe I can't show y'all. I'll show y'all a picture. It's coming up right now. Um, I got a tattoo with my grandmother's name big across my back. Um, and the day of her date of birth and the day she passed away. I got that tattoo, um, these are fogging up, but I got that tattoo September 12th, I think, September 12th, 2019, um, so I got that, me and all my cousins, we all got my grandmother name tatted on us, um, but, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so, with every tattoo you get at this tattoo shop, Every tattoo you get a free piercing. So I was like, okay, I want this tattoo. Um, and we all got the same, pretty much the same style of tattoo. Um, I'll show you a couple of my cousin's tattoos too. Let me get it on the snap. You see that? R.I.P. Grammy. I want, I want we love you. Like hey. Well, how does it feel? Mine on my back, but y'all see soon. Right. Yeah, so everybody was like, I think one of my cousins got a nose piercing with her tattoo. My other cousin got her tongue pierced. Two of my cousins got their tongue pierced. They got the uh, the snake. Is it the snake bite? Snake something. <laughs> this bitch. <laughs> Look at your ass. Look at this. <laughs> I feel like I got a lot. Hold on. Ah, oh, hood. Where it's like, uh, uh, they got those. And I was just like, y'all, I've been wanting to get these piercings for over two years. So let me just go ahead and get this free nipple piercing. So it came with my tattoo, y'all. So, yeah, long story short, I'm glad I did it. If you haven't got them done and you've been wanting to get them done, I say go get it done. It doesn't hurt that much at all. 
as you'll see in the clip coming up soon. Anyway, to clean my piercings, all I use is the Dow soap. It's antibacterial, you see that? So it gets all the bacteria, the little crusties that build up around the ring. You should use a Q-tip with the Q-tip at the tip of it, and then put a dab of soap on it. And then once you wet it up, go around your nipple piercing in circular motion, um, and then rinse it off. Simple as that, okay? Um, now for even more in-depth cleaning, you can put um, some, like on an alcohol swab, peroxide. Peroxide, you can wet a Q-tip or something and just put it around your piercing um, also. So, sorry y'all, I had to dry my face off. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. So I will be showing the clip of me getting my piercing um, coming up here. And if I have any clips of my cousins getting their piercing, I will also show that too. <laughs> it's a family thing. Hey. Hey. <laughs> okay. But yeah, thank y'all for watching. Stay tuned. Here goes the clip right about now. Oh, and whenever you wash your piercings, make sure to dry them, okay? When I dry them, I just literally do this. Dab, 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 dab like that. Do not rub it because the ring will get caught on your towel. So, that's a little tip because that's the one downside about a nip, uh, your nipple piercings is they will get caught on pretty much anything and everything. A pillow, uh, anything. Uh, your shirt, your daughter's hair. What else? The refrigerator door. These are just a few that has happened to me. So, take my advice. But anyway, I'm gonna shut up and go watch this clip right now. Peace. One, two, three. Put your hand right there. Put my hand, where? Ooh. Man, I guess I'm a puss. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, that's it. It mm -hmm. didn't hurt? It just felt like a discomfort feeling. Uh-uh. Girl, stop saying all over these big words. Just conference feeling. That didn't hurt. Yeah, but but I have, that's why I said I have a strong pain tolerance. Good. Like, none of my piercings hurt. The tragus. Hey, y'all. I'm back to end this video because I forgot to end it. Um, but also, I wanted to let y'all know in um in order to prevent your nipple rings from catching on to things it's best that you wear a bra um my issue is i don't like bras so um i usually don't have one on um unless i'm out and about sometimes um but yeah so in the beginning stages of the healing process, you definitely want to wear a bra, whether it's a sports bra or a, um, the push-up bras, because the push-up bras have the extra padding on there that'll really help protect the nipple um, from bumping into anything or getting snagged or anything. So that's very important. But yeah, if you like this video, go and check out my other videos on my channel. Your girl is lit, okay? Um, but yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let's get to a thousand, okay? 1K game. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, leave me a comment below. Let me know if you have your piercings done or if you, you're looking to get them done. Um, if you have any questions, just ask me down below and then I'll hit you back. But yeah, until next video. Peace. 
I can let you go with the best friend. I will never know. But here goes nothing. Sorry, y'all. That's the uh, song. Ashton Mark music played in the background while I'm getting my piercing. I just want to uh, sing y'all out like they do at church. Peace.